if water is leaking from your RCC roof and you are willing to fix this just in 30 to 40 rupees, you are at the right place. Do watch this entire video and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Hello friends, welcome back to my channel Civil Engineering Forum. Today, I am here with a cost efficient waterproofing solution where you can seal the water leaking cracks at your place by yourself and that too economically. So let us quickly start with this waterproofing technique by Civil Engineering Forum. Talking about all the equipments required for the technique. First and the foremost thing required here is waste thermocol. Then on the second number we need a little petrol. Next we need a syringe. Then we also need a brush. Next is a putty blade or we can say a scrapper. And at last a pair of rubber hand gloves are required. Now after going through all the equipments, we'll move towards the stepwise procedure for the waterproofing technique. So here our step number one is visual inspection from inside. That is we need to analyze our home from inside in order to check for the dripping water, leakages and dampness. Solution for which we'll see further in this video. Then step number two is visual inspection from terrace. As we analyzed our home from inside, we even need to check for all the water leakage spots on the roof or rather we would say terrace. Before implementing this waterproofing technique, we need to clean the surface like this. Then step number four is identifying the cracks. The cracks which are dripping water till your home interior should be identified and analyzed very efficiently in this stage so that we can make necessary treatment on it. Next, step number five is cleaning the cracks. Now using the brush, we need to dust and clean the cracks very carefully like this. Then our step number six is repairing the solution. Now to make these cracks waterproof, we have to prepare a solution using mixture of thermocol and petrol. Take a little petrol in a container. Unhurriedly start adding thermocol waste like this. Because thermocol is made up of polystyrene, it will not make any chemical reaction, but thermocol will melt when it comes in contact with the petrol. We need to add this till we get a thick viscous solution in the end. Now you might have understood that requirement of petrol is very less over here, making this solution economical. Now add this thick and viscous solution in a syringe like this. Next, step number 7 is grouting of cracks for first coat. Then we need to grout our cracks like this on its full length. Then our step number 8 is using scrapper or putty blade to finish the crack. That is using a scrapper or rather we would say a putty blade, press it on inclination on the side which you drag the blade so that the solution reaches the cracks and get compacted. Now our first coat is ready. Allow it to dry at least for 30 minutes. Then our step number 9 is grouting of cracks for second coat. Now again we have to repeat the procedure what we did in step number 8 for applying for the second coat over the first.
and in the similar manner we need to seal all the water leaking cracks and your waterproofing is done. So friends this is all for today. If this video was useful for you just click on the like button and do subscribe my channel Civil Engineering Forum. This is all for today. Thank you for watching.